Look at that little lovely boy, though. I love you, lovely boy. Oh, my lovely boy. Oh, no. And she got the milk. Isn't that wonderful? Hey, guys, it's me again. Welcome back to My Sims Kingdom. We're picking up right where we left off. And we're continuing on the tour. Crust, sauce, and cheese can be combined to make any old pizza. But the secret ingredient is Gino's pizza is fame! So did, wait, you had to be famous before your pizza was good? Well, how does that work? How did people like it first? Oh gosh, okay, so that concludes the tour. I'm going to go talk to old Gabby now and, uh, about something completely non-pizza related. Yeah. <laughs> sounds, sounds, um, sounds legit. Let's go. Uh, ah! This is why. This is why Tuffy is the worst. How the heck did she get out? Can she climb fences or something? You know what? I don't even care. Cows are free to leave as they please. I don't even freaking care anymore. And here we are. Uh, the freaking cutscene. Uh, hello there, Gabby. Huh? Oh, the chef. What can old Gabby do for you? Um, another special order, please. He doesn't seem too happy about this. Sure, one lucky horseshoe coming right up. Not so loud, Gabby. No one can know my terrible secret. Oh, I get it. His secret isn't fame, it's luck. Whatever, Gabby needs ore. You wait here, chef. I'm gonna... I'm gonna go up to a mountain and mine for a bit. <laughs> that's not... That's not how Gabby talks. Anyway, so what we're supposed to do after this is wait for Gabby to get all the way to the top here. He somehow got to the top before I did, even though he was clearly behind me. Now the darn blinking bridge is out. Gabby can't work under these conditions. Darn shabby bridge work. Build me another one and make this one good and sturdy. Uh, okay. I'll make you a bridge, I guess. Why not? I think I got time for that in my- I'm out of mana. Lindsay, help! I think I got enough time in my schedule to build a bridge. I don't know. Kinda, it kinda depends. I mean, building a bridge literally takes less than five seconds for me, so... There you go, and we have a bridge. Thanks for the help. Time to make that order. Alright. You do that. I think there's a scroll over here. So, yeah. In here. I think this scroll is for a piano. So... I should get that done before... Like... You know, before I forget about it, and then I end up... With a bunch of scrolls that I just haven't completed yet. Like I always freaking do when I play this game. Alright, Chef, one lucky horseshoe. Just let it cool for a second and it's all yours. Now remember, the uh, luck on that horseshoe only lasts for two weeks. And then you have to buy a new one for me. <laughs> Gabby is a scam artist. It's freaking hilarious. Yes, yes, of course. Um, guys. Yoink! Looks like it's my lucky horseshoe now, old timers! Oh god. <laughs> Out of all the villains in this game, he's probably the lamest. Dag blasted thief! Get back here with that horseshoe, burn gummit! <laughs> Is that really how cowboys talk? No! My luck! Oh, I'm ruined! I'll never make my world famous pizza again! <laughs> ah. Ah, thieving in the junction? Old Gabby won't stand for it. I'm forming a posse. But Gabby, where are you going to find a posse? Uh, hi, what's up? Done, Gabby found his posse. I didn't even realize what that word meant until I saw the freaking movie Rango. Oh, posse, is that a kind of soup? <laughs> yeah, Buddy is basically me when I first played this game. At the age of, like, eight. Nope, Gabby hates soup. Gabby likes the sweet taste of justice. To the sheriff, young'uns. <laughs> just trying to do the voices for these characters. I can't even. Gino, what just happened? It's terrible. A horrible man in a red bandana came and stole my new horseshoe. Why do you need a horseshoe? You don't have a horse. <laughs> yeah, and if you have a horse, wouldn't you need four horseshoes? Oh, oh my. I'll tell you, but please, don't let anybody know my secret. Do you want to know? So oh, my secret? No, I don't want to know it. That's not funny! The secret ingredient in my pizza isn't fame. The secret is luck! You realize how lame that makes you sound, Gino? No! That is lucky horse you will never get free samples! <laughs> I can't read the lines of this game out loud. 
I just can't. And here we are. Con Sarn and Sheriff. Darn blown at rats and frats and gully wumper. <laughs> okay, you watching right now. I dare you to say that without laughing. Say that out loud. Uh. Oh my gosh, a horseshoe thief here in Cowboy Junction? That's so satin. Who is it? Uh, Gabby's civic duty is complete. Gabby delegates the rest of his responsibilities to his boss. <laughs> That's, that's basically fancy talk for, I'm too lazy to do it myself, so I'm gonna have this group of people we barely know do it for us, alright? Is that cool? Alright, cool. Ginny, there's a bad guy, and he's eating all the soup. <laughs> no, no, buddy, I think you misunderstand. There was no soup involved. That was just you misunderstanding what a posse is. Stealing all the horseshoes. Yeah, thanks, Lindsay. Way to ruin it. Well, we need clues if we're gonna solve this terrible soup caper. No, not soup. Horseshoe caper. Oh, Lindsay. Lindsay's good at being logical and stuff. Right, for the horseshoe caper. But Ginny, we know who it is. It's a guy on the mountain with red bandana. But I can't make an arrest without clues. Clues are the best part of fighting crap. Okay, we saw him. There are like five eyewitness accounts. Isn't that good enough? Let's find clues. Okay, I'm officially making y'all my deputies. I'll put some uniforms over in the boat in case y'all want to dress the part. Now here's what I need you to do. Explore around Cowboy Junction and collect as many clues as you can find. Oh, right. Yeah, I don't need this ex explanation. I already know what to do. But... I would dress up as a cowboy, that, that's fun and all, but the loading times on this game are so ridiculous that I'd rather not bother. It's gonna take like 20 minutes just for the loading screens. Anyways, what we have to do is go around and find 10 red bandanas just scattered everywhere. Okay, first of all, how does this help anything? How are these bandanas, they're just, they're just, <laughs> how do these help us at all? with anything. And second of all, why does Rusty just keep dropping everything? He, does he just have ten bandanas that he just carries around and he drops them sometimes? Anyways, I'm just gonna grab this. I'll need it later. Let's see if I can remember where all of them are. Oh wait, no, there wasn't one over here. Just give me a second. This might take a while. I can never remember where all the bandanas are, even though I've played this game like ten times through. There's one here. They just keep getting- they're just getting stuck in cactuses. Like, hip. Ugh. How does that work? There should be one around here. Yeah. Right down here. There's one. Ignore the sounds of food cooking in the background. That it's not important to the mission. There are two up here. There's one here, and then there's one right over there. And that just leaves two more. Again, though, this all just seems relatively pointless. I don't get it. I don't get why you have to go around and collect ten freaking bandanas just to find the guy that we know has red bandanas. Wait. I don't get it. Alright, and now there'll just be one more somewhere. Hey, buddy, what's up? Hehe, <laughs> those old timers never knew what hit him. What? I didn't say anything. <laughs> You are like the dumbest criminal on the face of the planet. You know that, right? Even Markibus is smarter than you are when it comes to being a bad guy. And he's a freaking moron. Oh, it was just- it was just on this archway! How did I miss that? Okay, we have all of them now. Goodness, it's just a- just a big, long fetch quest of nothing. But- <laughs> Aha! Whoever stole that horseshoe must be wearing a bandana! Why didn't I see it before? Maybe because you're a freaking retard. Did you ever think of that? Uh, I'll have to replace the batteries in my Wii remote. Uh, it was, of course, it must be him. We have way more than enough evidence for this. Like, like, come on. Got you now, you shoe snatching gully wumper. What? <laughs> yeah, that's how I would react to being called that, too. And, well, I mean, we have enough evidence. That to prove that, but that didn't even work. Now leave me alone, you crazy girl. Don't I have enough problems? <gasps> Sniff. Oh, that's why he's bad at being a bad guy because he's not a bad guy. Hey, why are you so sad? Why am I sad? I live on a hill by myself. There's nothing to do up here. I'm bored out of my mind, and I'm. What? I'm lonely. <laughs> 
<laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't be laughing at that. It's really not funny. Aww. Sh shut up, stupid girl. <laughs> you baka. You're not a yellow belly gully lumpin' varmint at all, are you? You just needed a friend. Well, guess what? Uh-oh. From now on, you and me are best pals. I'm not leaving your side for a second. Okay? A little creepy there. But whatever. No, no, wait. I changed my mind. I think I'm better off being lonely. Come here, you. Let's play. Ah, you play too rough. Yeah, freaking calm down, Jenny. Maybe you need a whooping of your own. Ha! Help! Rusty said that before the lolcats ever did. <laughs> uh. Okay, wait. I don't need to see anything else. It's pointless. Anyways, he's just being a stubborn meanie head. I know we c that we can be good friends. Can you try and convince him to play nice? Perhaps. I don't know. Hey, Lindsay, excuse me. You're in the way of the camera. Okay, you know what? I don't even care. Oh, now she leaves. Okay, cool. Um. Chat. Let's chat it up. Uh. For some reason, every time we discuss Roland's quest, they just get bored. Every single time. This option comes up more than one time, and every single time, people are bored of it. I don't understand. It's not that boring. Explain property rights, obviously. Compliment Horseshoe. I don't know why I feel the need to explain how this game works. It's not like it's hard or anything. Uh, high five. I think I remember how to do this correctly. Yeah, there we go. You can go other ways, but it takes a lot longer. I think that was the shortest way, way to do it. Okay, anyways. There we go. Yay, now we can play! Except you might want to be, like, you know, not so psycho bonkers crazy. Okay, I'll play nice. Here are a bunch of scrolls I, uh, found. No, that was too many dots. You stole that, didn't you? Could you make my place less lame so I can, you know, lead a better life? Well, at least he's trying. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I got it, I got it. This one! I have to do this one. Because it gives you the stereo. And the stereo has the best song in the history of my sins. I'm not even kidding. I'm gonna do that real quick and then I'll be right back. I'd just like to point out that electric eels in this world are about as rare as dirt. Literally fish anywhere. Chances are you'll find an electric eel. Okay, well that's about as much time as I have left for this episode. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye!